Jump ball between Raptors 905 in Oklahoma City. And a pivotal game for playoff positioning. Tap controlled by the 905. Skilled guard. Sets up Phil Booth. No oh, good for the former Villanova Wildcat. But there's Cleveland inside. And finally, we get our first bucket of the game via Antonius Cleveland. This is Ellenson. Offensive rebound. Alizé Johnson up and in. This Brown number one and Alizé Johnson number two. Moses backing his way down with the left hand. Nicely done. Here's Ellenson on the take. His pass deflected. It's Booth the other way with Mooney to beat. Gives it off. Simpson leaves it in. 146 games played in Michigan, most all time. Alize Johnson, there's his eighth main three of the season. Not known as a shooter. By the cutter, Kevon Harris. Out to Tinkle, contested triple, no good. Nice rebound, offensive board. Alize Johnson back up and in. Great save in by Peyton. Here comes Tinkle. He has a size advantage on the six foot Simpson, and he takes advantage. Blue 0 for 4 from beyond the arc. Here comes Matt Mooney. The skilled Texas Tech Red Raider kicks it out to an open key on Harris who drills the triple. For the Dinosaurs. Pokashevsky, a deep three, and maybe that can get the blue going. See more of this from Alexei Pokashevsky. Almost looked like he wasn't really expecting a pass initially. The youngest player in the NBA this year. He turned 19 the day after Christmas. So he was 18 when he got drafted. There is an and one for GP2. The foul on Melvin Frazier Jr. What? Oh, and a slap at a backboard as well. Good ball movement. It's Peyton. Catch and shoot. And if he can make that shot consistently, he's an NBA player. Gets the pick. Going to work on Peyton. Stops and pops from the elbow and splashes it down. Arizona State Sun Devil by way of Cleveland State. Nice behind the back bounce pass. Harris setting up Ellenson. Tinkle on Horde. Off the glass and down. I think I would take that. I think I, I would want credit for the steal. Frazier a corner three. No, but there's the put back flush for Omer Yurt seven. There's the putback from Yurt Seven, just working his way around Ellenson, who just big time production down low. Good cut for Tinkle, Trace another lay in. Tinkle finds the cutter, it's Harris with the left hand hammer. Another turnover. It's been a disaster of a first quarter for the Blue, but they get it back and then. No, saved in by Edwards. And the lob for Yurt 7, just like Grant Gibbs drew it up. So Yurt 7 with another bucket as there's a deep three. Henry Ellenson from way downtown to end the first quarter. Has to be on some team's short list for being a call-up candidate. He's been to the NBA before. He is uber productive at the G League level all three years now that he has been there. Tap one by Frazier on the jump ball. Here comes Woolridge on the drive. Elevates and finishes. Woolridge. A look at Woolridge. Getting around Morgan. Again, we, we talked about Brown's free throw shooting coming into this game. Was that 61% and missed a free throw there? And then... A bucket the other way. Into the corner. Open three for Trace Tinkle. Feel like eventually they'll start dropping better than a 33% clip, which they're falling right now for Oklahoma City. Into the corner, Antonius Cleveland on target. Peyton. 
Stauskas sidestep for a triple, and it's down for Nick Stauskas. Those two were teammates with the Texas Legends last year alongside Moses Brown. Texas not in the bubble this year. A lob for Peyton from Mooney. Pokashevsky driving. Nicely done. Good touch on that runner. Johnson off the Euro step. No, he just wants to pad his rebounding stats. Well, they want to post up Johnson. They got the mouse in the house, Simpson, on him again. He's doubled momentarily. Feeds the cutter. Peyton, the nice extra pass, lasers it to Mooney, who kisses it in off the glass. Cleveland. Oh, nice look inside. Xavier Simpson, I tell you, he can flip the pill. Finding Pokashevsky for the dunk. Stauskas gives it up last minute, gets it back. And he missed his first five threes. He's hit his last two now. Behind the back pass. Bounced a little too far behind. And then Yurt Seven loses it. And here's Peyton off the feed from Alizé Johnson, who's a pretty good passer as well. 12 or so. That's probably the goal for them. Raptors 905 would like to bump this up to 20. But there's a turnover. And here comes Jalen Horde scooping it up and in. Not the possession the 905 would like. But Mooney tracks down his own miss. Ellenson, all kinds of space. That hook is part of his game. And Grant Gibbs saying his staff ran the numbers on it. And he shoots it at a good percentage as that shot was swallowed up by Pokashevsky. Here comes Poku down the lane trying to go coast to coast. There is a lot to like with Pokashevsky. You can see the skill oozing out of him. It's Stauskas, a nice drop off and a great dribble to go second side there. Into the corner. Booth, a three. That'll drop. Kind of did a hybrid entry with the Erie Bayhawks. Good look inside. Johnson, no good. Coming the other way on a run out, it's Antonius Cleveland off the window and down for seven points for him. And Booth, not quite. Mooney. Off the handoff. The shots he takes, uh, Moses Brown, should very rarely go one for seven. Simpson, a nice drive. Another Michigan Wolverine. All the way to the hoop. They don't stop Antonius Cleveland, and Patrick Matumbo is not going to like that. For the 9.05, the lead was 24. It is currently at 20. We welcome you back to play here. Kevin Dan on the call. Peyton on the step back. His second three, a very good sign for GP2. He also played pro in the G League, did Matumbo, for the Bakersfield Jam for parts of two seasons. And then in Greece and Italy. Stauskas nicely done in the lane. That's a good possession there from Oklahoma City. Still the shot's just not falling. Stauskas. Yes, sir. Cleveland at Frazier on the baseline. Pinned off the window by Johnson. Fast break the other way. It's Peyton gliding in and finishing. Continues the shooting lows for the Blue. Great move inside. Peyton high off the glass off the Proha with 17 points on seven of eight shooting. And then Frazier throws it away. Mooney. Finger rolls at home. Back in 2017 and made it back to the finals the next year in 2018. Mooney a three. Struggles continue. For the blue. Alizé Johnson down 33. Off the cut. Good pass to Kevon Harris up with the left. This is a team that averages close to 29 assists per game. They are pretty much on pace for that and then some. Woolrich, nice bounce pass inside. Horde goes up, lays it in. Loader up, no. Tapped around, taken away. 
He'll look past Woolridge off the glass and down. That is turning out to be a huge game. RGV's won four in a row. Back here, the 905 looking for their sixth straight win. In transition, it's Simpson. Setting up Booth. The three is there. Phil Booth has his second triple of the game. Peyton inside, lost it, stripped by Edwards. Oklahoma City trying to continue the long comeback trail. Edwards, a nice finish over Ellinson. Simpson, no good. And Moses Brown, that's what you like to see more of. Out to Ellinson. Open three is a rattled down. After the second week of play, he's averaging 20 and 13. Just hasn't been his night. As Ellinson hits back to back triples, getting to within 24. And Oklahoma City having a slight chance of getting back in. One assist shy of the second straight dub dub. That shot lasered short. And the second one lasered in. Mooney, float game on point. Assuming the blue don't get on a major league heater here to end. And there is that trademark hook. Tinkle. Goes to Mooney. His hook shot is good. He says, anything you can do, Xavier Simpson, I can do just as well. He's signing a two-way contract with the Milwaukee Bucks. Played for the Westchester Knicks here in the G League bubble and count it for Edwards inside, so. With the left, Woolridge nicely done. Alze Johnson wanted a whistle, didn't get it. Nice cross over Edwards. The Euro step, no. And you're at seven finally with the follow. Oklahoma City has a couple of tough games coming up. They got Erie and Santa Cruz. The two 10 and three teams, and there's about to be a third in Raptors 905. Dowskis bouncing it off. Here comes Henry. Big bank Hank with the flush and the timeout called by Grant Gibbs. Including that one from the corner. So it's Frazier inside. Tankle reversing it up and in. They average 18 of them per game on the season. Johnson approaching a 20-20. Kicks it out, and it's Tinkle from downtown. Fifth time in the last six games, Tinkle has been in double figures. He's got 14. Alze jumped in 19 points, 18 rebounds. So Frazier gets the end one. Jalen Horde inside, and a nice finish for the former Portland Trailblazer. Bounce pass into the corner. And Edwards is going to have a chance at a four-point play. Miss his own shot and then tip it home. That'll get him to 20-20. Oh, he's being too unselfish. Tinkle inside. Beating the shot clock and getting it to go. Comprehensive performance here from the 905. They've won six in a row. Nine of ten overall. And the 905 joining Santa Cruz and Erie at 10 and 3.